Hello, everybody. Today is January 15th. This is Zaratustra, and I'm broadcasting live from Los Angeles, California. And I'd like to welcome you all to Fifth Dimensional Academy of Higher Consciousness. Whatever mental activity and the story that you're in, which we all have that, as a part of the divine lila, the divine dance that we have, we're engaged, of course, naturally, but you disengage from that, you put everything on the shelf, you put everything on a hold, and you just come back for 10, 15 minutes, half an hour, 10 minutes, whatever, and you put the story away and you come here okay let me look and there's any there are some sound it is a bird oh yeah there's the bird sound like someone yeah okay so yeah we uh what we have is a bird i'm sorry it keeps banging when i come here and i start doing the webinar there's a bird that comes and bangs its beacon against the window very near me. So I don't know. I think the bird feels the juice and the love and wants to connect. So actually, Shishi bought an, a picture of an uh, owl, and we're going to have to hang it outside. Maybe it scares the bird and uh, pushes the bird to go away so it doesn't keep banging but it's it's a very resilient fellow <laughs> doesn't give up <laughs> so the anybody has any questions do you have any question for me if you do you can raise your hand and I'll unmute you and we talk. Oh yeah? Okay. I'm trying to, un okay. All right. Okay. I, I was uh, writing the question, so you can just read it. Yeah, that's easier for both of us, isn't it? No, uh, but uh, you already have it uh, in the chat. Oh, okay. So do you mind if I read it to everybody? Please. Okay, what's the difference between spirit and soul? Since people seem to be confusing, interchanging them. Right, spirit and soul. Well, I... I think what I I'm, I think I know what you're talking about, but to me there is no difference between you're talking about human spirit as your being, correct, or the spirit of of festivity or the spirit of uh, I don't know a, a football team. You're not talking. You're not referring to that. Am I right? I I am thinking of spirit as the life energy, like yeah. right, like yeah. chi. Right. Well, to me, it's the same. It's just different words pointing pointing out to the same thing. So, to me, there is no difference. Anything else? Anyone else? No? Okay. Could everybody? Yeah, Marit. Hi, honey. Well done. Hi. Um, do you have any experience with ghosts? Have I, do I have experience with ghosts? Yeah. I yeah, all the time. <laughs> all the time. <laughs> I have one here and he doesn't want to leave. Right, right, right. Okay, well, let, let's, it's, it's a good thing you bring up. So let's talk about it. 
right? So you, is this, this entity, this ghost, is it like in front of you all the time? No, I, I cannot see him. This okay. has seen him, but he's uh, hiding my things. That's how I discovered it. So, so there is a presence in your house. There is, there is a being that hides your things. Yes. Right. Yeah. I, I do have similar experiences, different times. It's not all the time. And they seem like they like precious jewels and gems, you know, like my rings. And my car keys. Yeah, and my car key. I was going to say that the next, next thing. So they seem like they, 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 they like to hide it from me every once in a while. So we have this little game with each other. Huh? He doesn't want to leave. He has yeah. to offer help to go over to the other side, but he he will not. He he will. He wants to stay. Okay. So, are you char charging him any rent? If I try to. Are you charging him any rent? Is he paying any money? <laughs> No, perhaps I should. <laughs> well, that's the problem. You you start charging him rent. And uh, he's going to leave. Perhaps no. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. I think maybe he, he has done something wrong or bad. Or I, that he's afraid to go over, afraid to be punished or something. Well, may, maybe he really enjoys your, your vibrations and he enjoys being around. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Remember it yeah well okay well let's say something we call it ghost or whatever there there is a presence there's an entity there's a being right yeah. and uh well they have as much right uh there there is all kinds of beings whether they're higher vibrational beings or lower vibrational beings that they're occupying the same space as we do. Like simultaneously, when you're here in your house or wherever, there is a, a, this space is being shared by all kinds of different beings from all different levels. They're sharing the same space as we do, as well as animals and you know, birds, crickets and, and uh, whatever, spiders, you know, there you, you know, summertime, you have all kinds of stuff crawling all over the place and they're sharing the same space and they have as much right to be there as you and I do. Mm, I know. Yeah, because we're all sharing this, this planet together. So, we have a tendency to say, this is mine, and you got to get out of here. But they're, they're here, like all of us. So the reason that normally we don't run into these different beings, and they can be high-dimensional, high-vibrational, you know, trans-dimensional beings, 